Let's use a high rate of fire. Oh, it's so sexy! Hey guys, before we get into this video with the Mosquito, I just wanted to quickly show you how amazingly powerful this AA truck is. Alright guys, this is an anti-air truck. Check it out. It's got this rotating turret overhead. How cool is that? Oh my god, that was cool. Oh, that was amazing. <laughs> Did I do no damage to this bomber? Look at the chat. He's going, what the? F he doesn't know what just happened. Oh my god, this AA truck is amazing. Gentlemen, this is the British Mosquito. Check it out, guys. Should we... Let's go back to that view and shoot. That's my guns. <laughs> I've also got four bombs. The payload size is 250 pounds. And I don't get it. Sometimes when you're kitting out your... Uh, loadout in the loadout screen and doing upgrades and stuff. It tells you kilos then you go in game and it says pounds. I just don't get it. I'm trying to go air to air against this BF109 here. Let's see how good it is. Oh man, it's got a high rate of fire. We've completely wrecked this Spitfire. <laughs> that was so cool. And check it out. There's a tank right in front of Bravo. We know what we're doing now with our payload. We're going straight for that tank. Let's see if we can get an instant kill and concentrate these bombs. Right in front of Bravo, yeah? Where was it? It was like right here, yeah? There it is. There it is. I'm going to concentrate it. That was, that was a kill, guys. That was a vehicle destroyed. You knew it was because all four bombs were right concentrated on target. That was beautiful. Oh, this mosquito has probably got... It's probably going to be sick, man. I'm a rank zero, by the way. I haven't properly flown this yet. Pretty much only just unlocked it. So, let's see how good it is, guys. So far, really good. And this, by the way, guys, this is the map called Hamada. It's in North Africa. And uh, I think it might be my favorite map. Still trying to figure it out. We just took out another tank. That is so cool. So good. But the thing is, you can do this with the German Junkers 88 as well, right? We already know you can get those air-to-ground tank kills with relative ease, just like this one. But the difference is, we've got significant air-to-air -air power with that high rate of fire. This guy, maybe it's good at killing infantry as well, if we can find some. I'm not seeing any traces, and as we know, that's how we identify our infantry. Ah, well, there's a, that's a tank. <laughs> I'm going for this tank now. Where is he? Where is he? There he is. Okay, just coming up on the crossroad in between. Okay, this is my biggest weakness, guys. When I did fly with this, I did try already. Uh, it's really bad if you've got a bug in your six. I don't know how I'm gonna. I don't know how I'm gonna outturn the bogey. I can't outturn him, so I'm gonna pull back on the throttle here. There we go. He's o he's overshot me. He's overshot me. Let's turn. Somehow win this. We can't turn as good as him, though. So he should win this. If he's a better pilot. But he's he's not turning into me. He's going to let me stay on his six now. This is funny. <laughs> Thanks, dude. Oh, no. He's pulling up. What's he doing? He's pulling back on the throttle or what? And now he's turning right. I can't beat this guy. He's got some moves. <laughs> Does he know I'm on him? Oh, and the anti-air gun. Come on, dude. Oh, yes, we got a wingman. Yes. Oh, come on, guys. Wingman, please get him. Please get him, wingman. Okay, maybe he is a good pilot because he knew I was on him. But we did 16 damage with that high rate of fire. In that short window of opportunity that we could shoot at him. That was cool. I'm pretty sure he's still on the left here. Yeah. Thank God for that smoke trail. Oh, that was so cool! Yes! The Mosquito is excellent at air-to-air, -air, as long as you haven't got someone on your six, and you can actually figure out some moves to get them to fly ahead of you. Then, it's great at air-to-air. -air. And it's a great air-to-ground. Let's find another tank, because the tanks are awesome. Maybe... Oh, there's a tank. Oh, you're mine, dude. You are mine. Oh, I didn't concentrate it. 
Yeah, I didn't concentrate it. And now I've got a... I've got a Yunkers on my six, guys. This is bad news. Ah, uh, but we've got a... We've got a wingman on the Yunkers. So I think we're safe. <laughs> oh, now there's an anti-air gun. Can't catch a break. Come on, you... Come on, wingman. You better kill that Yunkers quick. Yes, the wingman got the Yunkers. I heard him kill him behind me. Thank God. The wingman, by the way, is a subscriber, so... Mad... Mad appreciation to you subscribers for helping me out in the skies here. Mr. Bixmox. Let's get a max repair in. And find... That AA gun. Should we get revenge on that AA gun? Because he's, he's a real pest. Where's the AA gun? He better start shooting at me so I can find him. Or should we just get this tank here? Let's get the tank. We didn't get the kill. It wasn't quite concentrated. I think the splash isn't that big. But fair enough, right? Oh, and now the anti-air gun's waking up. Man, we're taking some damage. The game is kind of freezing up. What's going on? I'm just going to pass through this res resupply. Get our bombs back. <laughs> we are observing. A dogfight in action. We better save our wingman. No, our wingman just got killed by the BF-109. Which means I am undefended right now. Oh, uh, we'll deal with him later. Let's, let's use a high rate of the fire. Oh, it's so sexy! That high rate of fire is so sexy on this mosquito. Beautiful, and oh my god, that's the BF-109. I'm gonna go for the BF-109 and take him out ASAP. Because I am so vulnerable against him. I think he's got air radar. I think it's the only way he knows. He's definitely gonna be on my six now. Oh man. This anti-air gun. Get out of here, anti-air gun. <laughs> it's a very effective anti-air gun. I know a lot of people in my last video were complaining that the anti-air gun was not effective against airplanes, right? But trust me, guys. All anti-air guns are very effective against the light fighters. And maybe this mosquito as well. That might even be an anti-air truck. All right, there it is. Oh, do you know what? Let's get some revenge. Do you know what? You want to ruin my day? I hope that got you. And we got the reload, and we got the enemy hit. Did, was that enemy hit, though, on the anti-air gun? I don't know. It could have been a stray, couldn't it? But we're not seeing any more fire coming from the anti-air gun, so let's assume it was the anti-air gun. All right, come on. I want to see... If this thing is amazing at air to ground with the primary sort of machine gun, we just need to find some infantry. It's so funny how there's a resupply under the bridge. Oh, man. I did see some traces and I found a kill there. <laughs> it was very risky though. I was very low to the ground. And uh, if you are within blast radius of your own bomb, trust me, I've tried this out. You will die. <laughs> Alright. I'm seeing a lot of traces at Delta. Where, where, where? They're all in there. Oh my god. And... <laughs> Just for good measure, we threw the bombs down and found an extra kill. The beauty is, right? There's a whole lower altitude beyond the cliff that the A-guns just have no visibility view on this map, so... It's nice to put yourself in a position where you can line up your strafing run that you can just end it as you go down behind the cliff. So, note to self, that's what we've got to do. And uh, I'm being shot at down here by some tracers. I just dropped my bombs on those tracers, found a single kill. But the points are lighting up. All right, we're going to go high altitude and find out where that anti-air gun is. Because he's a real thorn in my side. Let's get some altitude. 
There he is, there he is. Oh, he's already on me. Come on, keep shooting. And he stopped shooting. Right, that'll teach you. Rank 2 on the Mosquito. Can we get rank 4 in one game just like we did on the Yonkers? <laughs> Come on, guys. Let's go for this BF109. He's a real threat. Oh, it's so cool. Look, he's already smoking up and almost down. I love the rate of fire. I can't say it enough. I love the Mosquito. This is a beautiful British machine. Thank you, guys. Thank you. Oh my god, I was very <laughs> uncomfortably close to that cliffside there. Very uncomfortably close. Alright, let's turn in and help our wingman because there's an anti-air gun. And the when you're a light fighter like my wingman is, you don't stand a chance against anti-air. You can't really shoot them down. Alright, that's him down. But just in case we missed, we're going to dive. Yeah, we got him. It's cool, we got him. <laughs> oh, man. I love this mosquito. Just pass through this resupply. It's cool, there's like three resupplies on the map. Should we save our wingman? Oh no, he's diving in my direction, so I better turn before letting him know I'm on a six. Oh man, I'm such a heavy ass plane. Here we go, here we go. Oh, what's wrong, mate? Is that a high rate of fire that you're feeling? <laughs> oh, he's in trouble. But he's, he's a better turner than me, so... But he's not going to keep turning. Oh, he's jumping. Oh, we did a road kill. We did a road kill. And we're being shot at by anti-air. You can corkscrew in this game. Just like Battlefield 1, guys. It's much harder to actually do the corkscrew in this game, though. But you can pull it off. And at the end of the day, you're guaranteed to evade some shots when you corkscrew. Even if it's not, you know, if it's too slow an aircraft like this one compared to the light fighters. You can still get away with it. Right, where was anti-air gun? He's a real bastard. There's so many tanks. Let's go for the heavy tank. We completely missed. I saw one tank. Uh, there he is, there he is. Oh, no, he's too fast. He's too fast. I think it's just the light tank. I wonder where the heavy went. Oh, you don't actually have a bombing scope in first person for this tank. Here we go. What's that? That's a... I just... Oh, I just got killed. I just got killed by the stationary weapon. No way. What's hurting me? Right, there's a there's a stationary weapon here. I'm gonna drop all bombs on that stationary weapon just for good measure. We got him. <laughs> just the oh, it's a double kill somehow. Fair enough. All right, let's turn back and find some infantry. I want to shoot my primary weapon at infantry because it's so damn beautiful. All right, all right, all right. Anti-air gun noted. Anti-air gun noted. But we got a bogey on us now. Oh dear. We've got a tail. We need to find a way to make him overshoot. We're going to make him overshoot now. <laughs> Such a little risky trick, though. Oh, no, I'm not, oh, not going to pull up from the cliff. The cliff, 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 cliff. Oh, we clipped. We clipped the tail. <laughs> that was a risky maneuver. Where's the actual enemy BF-109 gone? He's still on me. Luckily, we've got the wingman. There he is, there he is. Let's get some revenge. Beautiful rate of fire. He's down, but he's jumping out. Look at him jump out. That's so, so frustrating. <laughs> I just want to get kills. They don't let me. What can I do? 
All right, where's the anti air gun? We know he was somewhere. Is he over here somewhere? I'm seeing traces. All right, we're taking way too much damage over here. We're going to have to resupply, get the repairs. Let's gain some altitude. Figure out where we're going to shoot this. Where is the anti air gun? He's a real frustrating dude, isn't he? Right, with max repair, max rearm. We're feeling pretty good right now. Let's find out where to attack. Oh, what's that? What was that? Is that a tank? Can we make a last minute? No. Oh my god, he's actually going to kill us. No. Thanks for that. <laughs> Thanks to that cliff. We got away with it. What a beautiful cliff. That's a BF-109. Oh, we did a bunch of damage. I should be repairing, but I'm so greedy. Alright, we've lost him. Let's go repair. We've got a wingman to deal with the rest of the damage anyway. There he is. There's Mr. Tanky. We'll do a quick strafe on this bomber. We found the kill on the bomber whilst taking a bunch of AA damage. He's always shooting when I'm not looking at him. He's real sneaky. He's shooting at me now, and then he stops when I come into view. He's such a smart AA gun, isn't he? We did damage, but we didn't we didn't do enough damage. We're on three health. I couldn't quite align it. The speed kept changing with the position of the reticule. I kept change I kept playing with my throttle, and I think that might have been the mistake there. He's a real hard guy to kill, he's so sneaky. We're gonna rearm our emergency repair because we do need it when going head to head with the AA gun. He's a little beast, isn't he? He's shooting at the wingman. I don't get it. I don't get it. He's so smart. And now that I'm not looking at him, he's just going to go back in his AA gun. Beautiful. Beautiful. And now it's a great cinematic with the cliff and just scraping past it. Right, where are you? Where are you? You're mine this time. Yep. And the stationary weapon was destroyed. I hope it's not like Battlefield 1 where they can just repair it. Because <laughs> he's so frustrating. So all you guys who were saying in the last video that AA guns aren't powerful enough. The answer is yes they are. When you're good at what you do. Just like everything in this game, skill is rewarded, man. That was skill. Alright, there you have it, guys. That's the British Mosquito. It was really fun to fly, I'll be honest. I find it much more satisfying when you have an option to go for both air-to-air -air and air-to-ground. It's just that much more fun. And when you got that rate of fire on the Mosquito, it's just so cool. Oh, we've just upgraded it as well. Should we go find out what upgrades we can get on it? All right, so here it is, my Mosquito MK2. We're only rank two. We're almost rank three, as you can see. And let's see, what can we do? Just going down to the bottom, we've got four HISP 20mm quad light auto cannons, most effective against heavy aircraft and lightly armored ground targets. So you're not going to go after the tanks, just the light cars. Nah, that. what's the point? I've already got an awesome... I've already got an awesome cannon at the front, so I'm not going to choose that. This looks much more attractive. Dumb fire missiles. Eight times. Eight three-inch forward firing rockets. Effective against ground targets. I'm going to kill infantry with this thing, and maybe some tanks, even though we've got the bombs. Pretty sure this is on top of your bombs. And then you've got 50 cal browning machine guns, two heavy machine guns, both aircraft, and lightly armored ground targets. Nah, it's boring. This is where... I want this one, and then this is new. Lightweight package. Increased maneuverability from all... Control surfaces so I can turn faster and 
counter those guys on my six? Yes, we need that combined with that. And that's probably really good at aircraft. Like, imagine that these two, I'm definitely getting these two. What's this radar package? Probably useful, but I'm not going to do it. High altitude package could be good. Smoke screen might be good. Oh, I wouldn't know what to choose out of these two. I might end up choosing the high altitude. I don't know. And then increased rate of fire or instantly repair. I'm going increased rate of fire. And then we're going to buy... Oh, it's so hard to choose the high altitude package. And then we're going to go down here to dumb fire missiles, but we're not there yet, guys. And we've run out of credits as well. Anyway, that's the Mosquito. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Can't wait to check out all the other planes. We've got so much to check out still. So stay tuned as always. And don't forget to be a, an exclusive member if you want early access to videos, guys. And I'll see you next time. Peace.